see the, the see the steel. Wow! A Jap a Jap like a samurai sword. This is from Patrick. This is my father's. Really? Yes. Your father's? Yes. Was he a soldier in the army? No, he was uh, the sheriff of Newcastle. In That's there for really for put there for Ruby. I see. What else have we got? There's a gun there. Let me have a look through here. Away, or she might be a little bit of a spiritual voice. And there were some wonderful things like that, that he had no uh, self-concern. For example, I remember once when he used to be wear his robes before he be shed his robes. And um, we were walking down Oxford Street for some reason together in London, which is the main street in London. And there was a derelict alcoholic lying in the gutter, literally in the gutter, with the traffic sort of avoiding him. And Drumpa, fully robed, lay down, lay down beside him and uh, sort of tapped him on the shoulder, lying down in the road. And the drunk sort of opened his eyes. <laughs> and you could see he thought he was having a hallucination. And this is very impressive to me then, because I realized what Trunk was about. He looked at him in the, straight in the eye and said, with such earnestness, I, c I can't convey it. Now, he said, courage, courage, courage. And the man <laughs> looked at this Tibetan Lama. This is, of course, in the 60s when you don't have Tibetan Lama. There was no Tibetan Lamas in England, but maybe just two. Uh, or, or, or something, it was very, very rare. Uh, and uh, who knows what effect that had in his life, this guy. Well, I can only guess.